Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on WW Personal Points. Happy Saturday, it is Saturday so it is grocery haul day. This week I just did Walmart grocery pickup. I didn't need a lot this week because I just did that huge massive stock up haul, but I have some really good recipes planned. I can't wait to share all of that with you. So if you're excited, give this video a huge thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not. I would love to have you here. I do upload five days a week, so make sure you're subscribed and your bell notification is turned on. Check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching. I do offer personalized to you macros and calories. Start your new year off right Right? as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching if you would like to chat with me directly. Links, discounts to my favorite things, and of course my Facebook group are also down in that description box. So let's jump in to my grocery haul. So here's my grocery haul for the week. I just did Walmart grocery pickup. We didn't need a lot because I just did my huge massive stock up haul, but I did pick up some ingredients for recipes and a what as well as a few non-food items. So let me show you what I picked up for the week. First things first, a big case of Diet Coke for Troy, as well as Coors Light, which is out in the garage. I grabbed a new blind for my kitchen. The one in my kitchen is just old and stained and ugly, so I went ahead and picked up a new one. Some SOS pads, because I really like cleaning out my oven and my sink with these, and I was completely out. Toilet cleaning gel for my spare bathroom, so I don't have to carry the one that I have in my main bathroom all over my house, so I went ahead and picked up one for that bathroom. And also a big pack of hangers because both of us are out of extra hangers in our closet. Olives for Troy's pasta salad. I'm making his very favorite pasta salad for this next week. That recipe is on my website if you're interested. It is not a WW low calorie recipe, but it's a really good pasta salad. And I actually had ordered sliced olives and they didn't have them, so they substituted for full size olives. I will just go ahead and slice those myself. A box of penne pasta for that salad. What I found interesting is all of the pasta options at Walmart were sold out. There was only penne or bow tie. Every other shape was sold out. So let me know if you're finding that in your area as well. I thought that was an interesting thing to be completely sold out. Some pizza sauce. This is for a dinner recipe. I'm making a really yummy sheet pan recipe this next week that calls for shrimp and sausage. So I'm going to use the Sam's Club chicken apple sausage and then these extra large shrimp. Mozzarella cheese for a dinner recipe. I'm making a pizza type of recipe. That's what the pizza sauce and the mozzarella is for. A big block of the Colby and Monterey Jack cheese. This is for Troy's pasta salad. Diced ham, also for the pasta salad. Some whole milk for a dinner recipe. I have a couple recipes that call for whole milk. And then for my meal prep, I needed some dried apricots. I ordered the Walmart brand, the little small bag, because I wouldn't eat these other than in this recipe necessarily. And they substituted for this fancier brand and the value size. So I guess I will be having dried apricots in the future. Some frozen burritos for Troy. This is a super quick, easy lunch breakfast snack for him. And another three pack of my very favorite ground beef. This is the grass fed, grass finished ground beef. This is so good quality. It's very, very high quality meat and you get a three pack or three pounds for just under $18. Of course, a big bag of limes for my water. One sweet potato for that sheet pan recipe. I actually have a couple sweet potatoes left over from last week that I'm going to use up. So I just picked up one more just in case. A big stock of green onions and some radishes. These are both for that pasta salad. And lastly, a couple of bags of frozen broccoli. This has been my favorite go to bro veggie side with dinner. So that's everything that I picked up for the week. Like I said, not a huge grocery haul since I just did my stock up, but I'm really excited about the recipes that I'm making. So let me share with you what's on my menu for dinners and what you'll be seeing on Monday for meal prep. So here is this week's dinner menu plan. This is the week of January 8th through January 14th. So today, Saturday, we always go out for dinner or support a small business and do takeout. And then Sunday, I'm making Old Bay Shrimp and Sausage Sheet Pan. You guys will see this recipe in next Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. I'm really excited for this. And then Monday, I'm going to do Steak Bites and Sweet Potatoes. This also sounds so good. Tuesday is a leftover night. 
Wednesday, we're going to have a pizza night. Pizza night just sounds like something really good on these super cold snowy days. And then Thursday is leftovers and Friday, we are actually going out of town. Stay tuned for more updates on that in this next week's weigh-in video. And here is what is on my plan for meal prep. So this video will be out for you on Monday. For breakfast this next week, I'm making apricot overnight oats. That's what those dried apricots were for. And I'll be eating a lot of these since I have a lot of dried apricots. For lunch, I'm doing a Hawaiian pizza chicken. That's what this pizza sauce is for, the mozzarella cheese. Very excited for this. And then for a sweet treat, I am making cinnamon roll bread. It has been a long time since I've made a healthy, low point, low calorie bread, and I can't wait for this cinnamon roll one. So stay tuned again on Monday for meal prep. Thank you for joining me on another weekly WW Grocery Haul. I know this was a smaller one, but I hope that you got some food ideas, some inspiration from the recipes, and of course, stay tuned on Monday for my meal prep. If you enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not. Of course, I'd love to have you here. And check out that description box for nutrition coaching, as well as links and discounts to my favorite things and my Facebook group. Happy Saturday, friends. Have a fantastic weekend, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Bye.